Hello and welcome to Spotlight, and this week we are spotlighting Chester One, a game that I own. Apparently, we, so Tony, I, I I saw this game and I was like, this is a really interesting game because it's a platformer. Yeah. And you change the art style and it gives you like a power up. Yeah. I thought that's really interesting, and it had quite good reviews. And I was like, well, let's try the demo of this. And then I was just looking through the store page so I could talk about it while we do the spotlight. Turns out you own this game. Yeah, unless it was like 69p or something, the summer of sale or something. I it's like two know. quid at the moment, I think. These yeah, signs are so annoying. Yeah. So you have to collect these stamps, and these stamps let you buy new characters. I am... Um, so this is Chester. He can slow down time. This is who you start as. Do, do, do. We've purchased Bit Chester per your request, and he's got water yeah, element. This is in-game purchasing, by the way. This isn't like downloadable content no. shit or... The whole just, point of just, the game is to It's like a earn, real game. The whole point of the game is to earn stamps to unlock more characters yes. to play the game. And more art styles. Oh wait, these guys are, I can't use this guy. Oh you can't These guys are They're water based. Yeah, I can't use water. But look, if I pick up the cupcake, it changes the art style. And it has different pa up effects. Yep. Different power ups, different art styles. So ooh, 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 ooh. Why do I not know what the hell this does? Why am I always getting cupcake? Oh, this slows down time, this one. Yum. Yeah, the sweet slows down time. Chester 1. Chester no, I'm not two. Chester 2. <laughs> Chester number 1. <laughs> it's just such a weird art style, though. The platforming is really good, like surprisingly oh, okay. good. I didn't think We're it using was going to be Xbox as good. Controller. Yeah, but there's I've played other platforming games with the, with an Xbox controller, and the platform is just yeah. been terrible. No, I just I just wanted to let the audience know that that's that's what we're going by. You using a, an Xbox I'm, if I'm playing a platforming game on always, yeah. spoiler, I'm using an Xbox yeah, controller. Yeah. From this, well, we have to say every time we've got so this not, candy gives me low gravity, but I can slow down time as well. What the fuck was that sign? It's saying you're just gonna eat some random candy you found on the floor. Okay. You got a tick. I don't know what that means. It's a checkpoint activated. Be cool if we get FD. There's a collectible that I found that if... I've played through a tutorial before. Oh right. I'd be cool if like games told you like how many checkpoints were left though. That'd be kind of useful. So this slows down platforms, I believe. Oh, this. That's gonna help me collect that... stamps. What even is that? What's that supposed to be? Slower enemies. This one. I still like the music, I think the music is cool. It's very chill. Yeah, it's a chill game. I like, the, I like the sound effects. Some of them are a bit weird, but... I think the, I think the jumping is like based upon what character you have selected, so I let him off. I don't like the signs though. The signs can fuck off. <laughs> I can I I, to I, slow down time. On the ice I slide, but it's pretty hard to control my character. Oh right. Oh, where, you, you got a life bar. Is that what is in the top left? So I slow down time so I can collect that. That's good. Collectible. I like that. Lethargic enemies. So these enemies are like... Not as quick, I guess. Oh, I stepped on the ice. There we go. Yeah, so you gain experience with individual characters. So my oh, I fire see. chest is level 3. 8-bit chest is level 1, but the thing is these frogs are, they don't take any damage when you're water, because yeah. they're like water resistant, because they're frogs. Of well, they're, just, they're just absorbing, they're not even really resistant, they just, they just like it. Oh, I need that one stamp. There we go. You have to collect them all. Just like Pokemon. Yeah, but oh, he, he doesn't collect them all though, does he? Dear loser, I stole your cupcakes going to space to like destroy your multiverse or something. Sniff you later, TBG. What's that style for? Uh, the bastard guy. I, so I don't understand this. It says you are the win level. <laughs> it's just I don't know a if meme. the person who made this spoke English. No, it's just a meme. I don't know though. Oh. I like this one. This is a good level. This Are those chain? Oh, that's not chainsaws. Um, oh, I need uh, to switch to blue chest one, maybe. What's with the sound? What? They're in great pain. <laughs> what? Wait, does 
Does uh, Earth Chester, is he better against blue things? <laughs> yeah, that's so strong. But playing as 8-bit Chesters really changes how the platforming feels. It's weird that like, good animations yeah. can like... Makes a lot of games, like, I think a lot of games make the animations make it, right? Arthur's gonna kill you, like, uh, you wanna be the guy. Or the boss you. Reduce gravity. Oh! Uh... Oh, well I got the page, it's all that matters. Does that, does that get saved up? Oh fuck me. <laughs> Been you deaded. have been dead. It's definitely a no. meat <laughs> No. Oh, these are so slow as well. What's my power up? Block mines. What? I get block mines. What does that mean? I don't know. Oh! I d <laughs> Look how weird that is. I feel like it's just the developer just like talking to a microphone. I want to get back oh! to fire chest. Yeah, that's how he got it. He <laughs> recorded some raw gachi. Yeah. <laughs> Door. I got a checkpoint. You can pass through and lays unharmed while its color matches your type. Oh my god. Otherwise, you will die a painful death. <laughs> <laughs> this is, it is really distracting, actually. Oh Ooh, god! Fuck. <laughs> I can see it. Oh my god. This is not for the faint of heart. I would not be able to do this oh, like, on my first try. This I'll be here for hours. I'm almost dead, like. actually. Yeah, Fire Chester is. But not. Bit Chester. Yeah, oh no, we, you share health. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry to say. I'm like... trying to annoy it. I'll be these creepy that, that laser sound, though. Oh fuck this guy, dude! <laughs> Block mines is the only one. But these things suck. <laughs> fuck this oh. character, dude. <laughs> you got him. There's another one in the sky. Yeah, maybe. he's up there. Oh, you didn't. What? Is he frozen? Oh, there's the other one. Run! <laughs> Run! I, I like the idea for. Oh. I like the, 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 the type of enemy looks really cool. I like, I like the concept. Just keep running, just keep running. And you are oh, win the level. <laughs> it's are. as easy as that. I don't like the sweetie part. That's, that's kind of scary. Or in space. Welcome to space. You can tackle the worlds in any order you want. Beat the world to unlock its magical candy for unlimited use. Oh, we have to go all of the worlds to get to the big bad world. Keep buying new chesters from the shop to help out. So we need to. We can beat the world in any level we like. We have to get all of them to get but the we skull. Have, yeah, we the have hell? to get all of them to uh, fight Reaper from Overwatch. Oh, it's <laughs> quite a lot of content, then. Yeah. <laughs> my, it's my favorite it's enemy so too far. Too fucking distracting, dude. <laughs> what is that? Oh, oh. Is that launch you? Yep. Oh, I like these. Can I just say that these levels remind me a lot of the levels you can make in like Little Big Planet 2? Like a lot of these mechanics are in that game. Do you remember that Dreams VR game? Uh, that like Dreams game on PS4? It's like you can make any game in this sandbox game. Oh, vaguely, yeah. I saw they, for the anniversary of Little Big Planet, they made Little Big Planet in Dreams and it looks amazing. It looks. Oh, really? It actually looks like. Because apparently Little Big, Little Big Planet 3 came out, but it wasn't made by a media molecule, like the other two were. That's as easy as that. Also, I don't I don't remember the... Because the first game was narrated by a Stephen Fry, which, yep. was, which was great, by the way. And then the next Second one was narrated by Peter Molyneux. It would be great if Peter Molyneux <laughs> narrated a Little Big Planet. If we ever make a game, I want to try and get Peter Molyneux as a narrator. And guys, it's going to be great. <laughs> And look at the little ball of yarn, and you really have to come to some decisions on how you make it through the level. Do you want to build your way out, I think or do I... you want to try and brute force is, it? Is he doing my, my director's cut for me? <laughs> little big, little big Peter Molyneux. Thank God it's frogs, dude. I, I, I'm, I'm a frog. Ah! <laughs> oh, we collected the sport. Oh, oh, fuck me. Oh, fuck me, dude. I am deaded. 
Oh, not these guys again, dude. Very strange sound design on these guys. <laughs> this game's gone from like a 5 out of 10 to 10 out of 10 for me. Dude. <laughs> Block Chester even sucks at just fucking jumping, dude. Yeah, he doesn't jump as high, does he? Interesting. Oh my god. So it's a really like nail at wall jumping in this game then. There is auto wall jumping in the options menu, but you the can't- The scrubs like me. You can't get to the options menu while oh. you're playing the game. Which is an interesting design choice. Uh, yeah, it was definitely a choice and not an oversight. Um... I mean, this game is like two quid on Steam. Well worth it, and I'm pretty sure I bought it for less. So I still can't believe you bought this game. So like, you know, shit talking you, you it for know so what, long. You know what, Joe? I can't believe I bought it either. Were you <laughs> drunk at the time? <laughs> I guess. You were just like, I'm just gonna buy just the one, just the pistol. <laughs> Got him. I can play it before him. I won't. Oh, thank God, I got a checkpoint. Can we get more of the screaming? Oh, here we go. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh my god, this is actually... The, the platform is actually really solid. Oh god. It looks really difficult as well. Oh, oh shit! Oh god, oh god! Is this a moving platform? That's invisible? Yeah. Oops. Timing those are really difficult to get in the right direction. Give me a checkpoint, bro. Give me a checkpoint. No. Is it probably on though? Wait, what the fuck? Where there's am I switch, going? There's a switch to the right, he gets it. No. Oh. You have to go up? I can't go up, there's invisible. Can you go down? There's a glass ceiling. Oh, can you go down? Oh yeah, I can actually. Uh, no, not here. What the fuck, where am I supposed to go? There's a little gap up there. I can't go through it. I'm trying. I'm, I'm confused. Oh. <laughs> what? I'm supposed to just break it. Uh, no, I'm, that was not I'm obvious. Silly. It wasn't obvious that was breakable. I'll, I'll let you off on that one. You missed one. I can't believe it. Oh. These things. Oh god. Oh god. Ah! It's like cluster bombs. Another moving Gary. platform. This is reminding me of like a, a really game well. This was actually fun. I'm, like enjo a, I'm really enjoying playing this. This looks like a really well made oh, Lewis shit. Planet game. You know? I've been deaded! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Every time I die, it's like. Dun, dun. Oh god. Well, good luck. <laughs> All the way back, don't I? I think someone might have said they're like stingy on the checkpoint. Might have been a complaint. Yeah. They still would have recommended the game though, so... It's already got seven user reviews. How many people do you think have played Chester 1? Seven. Yeah. <laughs> and now eight. <laughs> Hopefully more. No, well, definitely you. Sure. Did you, you have the game, apparently. I, I have it, just have not played it though. I have many games I haven't played. Like, I have Shadow of War. I haven't played it yet. This is playing on normal mode as well. What? It gets more harder. Yeah, you can play on no. hard. This is not for the faint of a... I think there might be two more difficulty things. Oh my god. Got the sweetie. I definitely... Oh, what the it hell? does something. Got, you've got a like green... Come with the... Oh, where did we die? Here. Here? Oh! I see why I see why you died. These fucking blue mines, dude. The whole building's moving. Give me that checkpoint, boy. Give me that checkpoint. I actually really oh, want to I actually really want to play um level planet two now though. Oh my god, this is actually pretty hard. Yeah, it's good. What the <laughs> fuck? How did I die? A random bullet came out of nowhere to hit you. Are you kidding? Well, no. Are you kidding me? <laughs> wow. 
Give me a fucking break. Give me a checkpoint. This is like the first proper level after this is for your No, because you can play them in any order, so this is probably like one of the hardest ones. Oh. <laughs> I'm probably on the final level right now. <laughs> this is what happens when you don't have linear level design. I just go, well, I've never played this game before, let me pick this one. Oh, it's the hardest level, okay. But this could this could actually still be the easy level. <laughs> yeah, don't this know. is just like this is, this is like tutorial level. We don't know how hard this gets. It only gets harder from here. You've been warned. Can you not Fuck me, dude. If he has so much health as well. Crazy. Yep. What are you gonna do? Uh, I'm just gonna watch and say I'm, I'm probably never gonna complete this game. I mean, you have this game, you, you'll love it. I didn't mean I'm gonna complete it though. Oh, <laughs> fuck off, dude. I died in two hits! <laughs> to some of the attacks, yeah. I'm getting bombarded with bombs the second I move. <laughs> you need to get good. Yeah, I do need to get good, actually. Easy. <laughs> I need to be able to dodge bombs. Get good. And invisible platforms. What, what's the point of getting these uh, boxes? So that's like experience. Stamps? Yeah. Uh, you can buy new characters. So They're like currency. Yeah. There's a stamp, it's okay. Those customables are nasty, but... It's the blue ones that get me. I think the, yeah, the red ones are fine. The, the ricocheting ones. So they just bounce everywhere, oh! dude. They've got hit. Yeah, I'm gonna get hit again, probably. No, you're not. You're gonna win. I Look, it they platforms. go through walls. These guys are really tough as well. Let me kill this guy off screen. Well, they're slower with the upgrade. Got a brain. Right, this is where, like, out of nowhere, all this shit does attack you. Oh, it's this fucking yeah. weird blue thing that's summoning them. I think I might have debated him. <laughs> what? He just jumped off! <laughs> and it's as easy as that. You can do that in the original Mario. You can just yeah, bait enemies true. to jump off the edge of cliffs. Right? I should, last Give I, me a I, checkpoint. For, I, fuck's, I for fuck's sake. Oh. Yo. You are the win level, now you boys. Now you understand what that means. You are the win I am the win level. I don't like the you sweetie part. I don't, I don't know why. I don't like it though. Should we call it there? <laughs> I'm not playing in that one. <laughs> I'm not playing one either. Yeah, that was. I actually, I actually looks... enjoyed that game though. I, I'm a, I it like fun yeah, to play. The platforming looks great, really hard, but yeah, the, some of the art styles are really weird though. But... I like. It, I just thought it's a really interesting concept. It's like a platformer, but you yeah. can like change the art style on the fly. Yeah, it's interesting. I like wish... an entire game based around that is really interesting. I just wish I could make a loadout of all the art styles I actually liked. So this is Chester One. It is two pounds uh, on or, Steam, regional or your regional equivalent. Uh, it's developed and published by Brilliant Blue G LLC. Uh, that has been Spotlight. Goodbye. Bye.